Hello everyone, this is Sammy Chase here with a Monster High doll review. Today I have one of the original Frankenstein Dead Tired dolls. She's an oldie but goodie. I found her at a store for a nice price, so I picked her up. So without further ado, let's get a closer look at Frankie. This doll is pre-reboot, so she has all the original molds. She's a nice softer makeup palette because she is dead tired. She's going to be going to bed. You don't want to stamp your pillows with all your red lipstick. So I really like that. Her hair is side swept for the bangs and she has a nice full side ponytail. She has a cute little eye mask that matches her PJs. For her PJs she has a cute fitted tank top with a lightning bolt on it. It shows a little bit of her belly with the very bottom of her belly button which is really really cute. And then she has these matching PJ pants that are silky with stripes and lightning bolts and some plaid at the bottom and at the top by the little drawstrings. She's super cute. She has these cute little freaking monster slippers too. I really like her. Hopefully when they do the reboot Dead Tired dolls, eventually they'll get this nice of quality again. I don't really like it that much when all the dolls are just the same old characters wearing like a different kind of nightgown that's a different pattern or there's some there's a few little differences here and there. I really like for this first line they all did very different outfits. And they made their all the different ghouls have their nice own unique bedtime looks. So yeah, I really, really like her. Hopefully they'll return to this style sometime in the near future. And since she is pre-reboot, she of course comes with this nice skelet hairbrush. I mean for how many of these I have and eventually I got tired of getting them with every doll, I do kind of miss them. I wish that they had hairbrushes with at least the more expensive dolls. If I were to give this doll a rating, I'd have to give her a 10 out of 10. I really, really like the quality of these dolls in the first Dead Tired line. All their outfits were original. No two were dressed alike. They just had so much more personality. The quality of the dolls are great. The paint job is amazing. Fully opposable. The clothing quality is great too. You can see the stitches. There's no missing hems or whatever like I've seen with some of the newer ones like they've they cut corners now. I just really wish that they had stayed with this quality of doll for the whole brand instead of cutting corners like they are now. Hopefully they will return to these standards in the future but until then I can just cross my fingers. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you have not yet, hit that subscribe button to stay updated on all my new videos. And I'll see you guys later.